Imagine people walking into your home, your office, or even a commercial space and seeing amazing wall art on the wall and just saying, wow, well, that can happen. And today I want to show you what's available. Hi everyone, I'm William Whitman from William Whitman Photography and today I want to show you samples of each of the different media types that I offer on my website because when you're looking for a stunning piece of wall art to transform complete a space in your home or your office selecting a beautiful image is actually only the first step you also want to think about the different types of media type because each one will have a different look, a different effect for a particular space. Okay, everyone, let's go ahead and just jump right into it. Uh, first, let me say that each of the samples that I'll be showing today are base samples. Of course, each media type on my website has many different options that are available. But today, the idea is just to give you uh, a look at what the difference that each one looks like. And so uh, with that, I'm going to start with a Kodak Endura metallic photo paper print. This is printed on archival paper, which means that this will last for years to come. It will maintain its vibrance and boldness won't, won't yellow or anything like that. So my first sample here is a print that I call, an image that I call the, um, the Lake Bridge. And here we go. This is Kodak Endura Metallic Photo Paper Print. And I apologize for the reflection. I'm right up on the computer and of course the lighting. And it has a beautiful gloss finish, as you can see. Now let me show you the detail here that you'll see in this. It's absolutely stunning. Okay, Kodak Endura Metallic Photo Paper Print. Now this particular sample I have printed on 2 millimeter styrene backing and I'm going to talk about that. This is important. So just look at this beautiful print. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump over to the website and here we are. You come over to the website of course I've got all these beautiful galleries here and let's go into the general landscape gallery Okay, so let's talk about the first media type here that I'm showing. The Kodak Endura uh, Metallic Photo Paper. There's five different media types here. And of course, when you click on the, this little black thing for each media type, it'll bring up a little tool tip to give you more information. But it comes up here, I'm gonna hit continue. I'm gonna select a size, many different sizes available. And then what's going to happen, I sit, hit continue again and we come to styles. Now this is important because what is available for um, photo paper prints, you can purchase just the print. Um, but I don't think you would want to do that. I do, um, I offer that option. Okay. There are mats available, one inch, two inch, of course, framing. We're going to talk about that. And two millimeter styrene backing. Okay, and this is, has the backing on it. So let's say you wanted to order the print and you did not want to order framing or matting right now, I would highly recommend that you select the two millimeter styrene backing. That's gonna give it some, um, some foundation, some you know, rigidness um, for mounting. Then you could then take it to uh, your own framer in matting place if you wanted to do that. But as I say, what we have available here is different matting options. As you can see, one inch, 
two inch uh, standouts. And again, this will give you information about what that means. Let's go back to, um, we'll do a two inch matted print. We'll select frames. And when we select frames, as you can see, there's another option up here. So I hit continue. And of course, I have many different framing options that I can select from. So this is the uh, Kodak Endura Metallic Photo Paper Print. Okay, everyone, let's move on to the next media type, which is one of my favorites, is high gloss metal print. And with this, I'm gonna be showing you an image of, that I call Raccoon Eyes. It's in my wildlife gallery. And so here we go. Beautiful high gloss metal print. Just look at that beautiful finish there. And I'm going to show you some detail. Okay. Amazing detail. Now, metal prints are one of my favorites for a lot of reasons. First of all, I want my work to be bold and vibrant and really jump out at you. And I believe metal prints is one of makes that happen. Now the thing about metal prints are they are scratch resistant. Uh, you could put this on an outside porch with direct sunlight. It will not fade. They're easy to clean and they have a wonderful mounting system as you can see right here. Um, this uh, clean hanger system right here. Very durable. Very durable. And another great thing about metal prints is as soon as you receive them and take them out of the box, they are ready to hang on the wall. There's no matting or framing required, though there are framing options for metal prints on my website, which I'm going to show in just a second. So let's do that. Let's go over to the website. And Here we are, we come to uh, this image here, uh, Raccoon Eyes in the Wildlife Gallery. And first let me mention the price that you see here is the minimum price for the smallest um, print available in any given media type. So that's uh, the least expensive price that you could purchase a high gloss metal print for this image is $389. So, we're going to go to the next step, hit continue, I'm going to select, I'll select a larger size here. And then we're going to select the styles by hitting continue here. And here we go. So this right here, this float mount hanger is what I just showed you on the back of this image. There are many different options here, okay, um, that you can pick from and they give you information about each one. And of course, you could even frame uh, these metal prints. And I highly suggest uh, putting on 1 8 rounded corners here. Okay, so those are high gloss metal prints. Okay, everyone, let's keep moving. Uh, the next media type are called canvas gallery wraps. This is a, um, more traditional look in my opinion. Again, for any given space, you also want to select the right type of media for that, uh, for that print to work well in your space. So the image that I have on this uh, sample is actually a throwback from my portrait photography days. I'm not doing portrait photography anymore. I have new samples on order. But the main point is to show you the quality and what it looks like, what a canvas gallery wrap looks like. So here we go. This is a beautiful image. I had the opportunity to work with this lady out in the Nevada deserts. You can just see the beautiful detail and the texture. And I'll come up a little bit closer here. 
And on the back is very simple mounting system called a cleat hanger. These are very lightweight. And the nice thing about gallery wraps are um, when you receive them, again, right out of the box, they are ready to hang. However, there are framing options for uh, canvas gallery wraps. So let's go ahead and go back to the website and we'll take a look. So here we are, I'm using this image here. This is um, Sunshine Skyway Bridge in my fine art gallery. And we're on uh, canvas gallery wraps here. Let me, let me go back here. Uh, canvas gallery wraps. We're going to select the size 36 by 24. And of course, the next thing will be select our style for that wrap. And here we are. Now this is what's called a mirror image. The mirror image simply means that the image goes around the, the sides and continues as a mirror. Another option, of course, is selecting a border color and many different colors available. I personally like mirror image. Three quarter inch gallery wrap, framing options available, and then there are different finishes that you can pick from here. So these are beautiful canvas gallery wraps. The next media type is again one of my favorites. It's acrylic. I just think it adds such great visual impact to an already stunning image. So here again, the sample here um, is a throwback from my uh, portrait photography days. But again, the purpose of this sample is just to show you uh, the impact and the quality of these prints. So this is acrylic. And again, I had the um, fortune, I was very fortunate to work with this beautiful professional ballet dancer. As you can see, beautiful finish and just very, very impactful here. Very sturdy and durable, great quality. The mounting system, very easy. You would put this in the wall and of course then mount this right on top. So very easy and again, just like metal prints, uh, you, you uh, receive it, take it out of the box and put it right up on the wall. Okay, so this brings us to the last media type that I'm going to talk about, and those are wood prints. Now, I've just added these to my website, so unfortunately I don't actually have a physical sample that I'm going to show, but let's jump over to the website and take a look. Wood prints, I've picked an image here in my mountains gallery. This is Grand Lake out of Colorado. Stunning place, stunning image. Uh, but here we are, wood prints with a white finish. And these are half inch uh, maple wood prints with a white ink underlay so that it maintains um, uh, the consistency and, and vibrancy of the image. Absolutely beautiful. I will have a sample here soon to show. But Again, I'm going to hit continue. We'll pick a size here and uh, continue again. Go to the styles, and you can select here having a half inch border if you like. Um, but very straightforward, and again, very, very easy, ready to hang as soon as you uh, receive them and take them out of the box. So, maple wood prints.